Hello guys. Scores of lawyers under the ages of Ikit Lawyers Vanguard for Transparency have petitioned the chairman of the National Judiciary Council, NCJ, Honorable Justice Kudirat Kekere Ekon, over alleged controversy rulings and other misconduct of justice in making Mati of a federal high court in Abuja. The legal practitioners further accused Justice Mwati of bias and desecration of the hallowed temple of justice with what they described as unjust conduct, maintaining that the judges' actions were capable of bringing Nigeria to great disputes if they are not corrupt. The lawyers claim that Justice Mwati's alleged unjust rulings were embarrassment to the body of uh, benches expressing dismay that Wati, who restrained the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission, the EFCC, from proving Oluwashan Adewale, the former aide to ex governor Kayode Fayomi, and Aroyo Unikorawale Ados Adeshola, and shaded them from persecution on the alleged role in corruption cases was the same judge who issued the controversial bench warrant for the arrest of the former governor of Kogi State, Alaji Yayabelu, despite the, 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 the dependency of an order of a state high court stopping his arrest and persecution. The petition was addressed to the chairman of the N. GC and signed by 10 lawyers. Okay. On the behalf of 54 lawyers who are members of the Vanguard. Well, I've said it's time with that number. That this Nigerian judiciary will eventually set Nigeria ablaze. Nigeria is actually a theater of, I don't know, of war. Judiciary strike and to be rescued immediately. Hmm. Well, uh, then they talk say anything one person do today, a day front they wait for them. These people, they are supposed to be the people's God. Uh, understand me? You know, somebody when who your matter, when who your judgment is expected to be, you know, your kind of, I am looking up to you. You have to, you know, do the needful. But these judges, they have lost it. You understand? These people who suppose, you know, to keep Nigeria together, they have finally, they have finally scattered the country because of their selfish interests. This is really very bad. This is really very bad. You understand you know the truth but you cannot just you cannot just do you know uh go for the truth because of your selfish interest look at what is happening today look at the drama that happened on friday these are the judges the same judge the same the same judge he was the one that ruined against those uh, uh protesters those young children even talking about 10 10 million naira bill for these children. They have, they have, their, parents, their parents get 1,000 naira and they came out to come and protest that they are hungry. I don't know. I don't know. Because things, things this is getting out of hand. You understand? You know the truth, you are not doing it. You are not saying the truth, you are not standing for it. And you, to you, you feel that we go unpunished. How? How? It's not possible. See what they have turned River State into. Shade they talk before say court is the the the, the poor man last hope. It's no longer like that in Nigeria. Today Nigeria has been given different names. You understand? Nigeria has been given different names because of these people. Nigeria has been given different names because of these people. Well, my people, are they dropping for you? What's your take on this? Kindly drop your comments below the comment section. And don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Please share this video. Let it go viral. 
Let Nigerians understand what is happening today in the Nigerian political landscape. Thank you and bye for now.